When I was a girl, I thought my mom was like the most beautiful, glamorous woman like in the whole world. She was a very uh, jovial person, charming, fun at parties, but she was also really critical. She was critical about herself. She was also critical about me. Criticism was usually about what I look like, like me being in my mom's room and my mom looking in the mirror and saying things like, I'm ugly or I wish I didn't like have this stomach or the cellulite. I was a chubby baby and I was like a little fat girl like my whole life. My mom told me that like that no one would love me looking the way that I looked. Like who would want to be with or marry like a, a fat girl. When I was a girl, I didn't understand that it was wrong for, for my mom to say those things to me. I thought that I deserved it. So like when I would hear, you know, you're fat or you're ugly, who's going to love you looking like that? I thought I really deserved that. Becoming a mom, I realized that that was a choice. It's a choice that I, I couldn't see myself making. I knew that I needed to do something different. For me, becoming a mom, I think has been the most transformative experience of my life. I thought like I have spent years thinking about my body in these negative ways, wishing my body away in different ways. And then it had done this for me, like it had given me this baby that I now loved more than anything. I'm just really trying to be the mom that I needed when I was their age. I think that if you want to break the cycle of growing up body insecure and you don't want your daughters to, to grow up with that. Maybe I didn't have an example for how to be body confident from my mom, but it is an example about what not to do. The most important thing is that they have their own perspective and that their perspective doesn't have to be mine. They are not an extension of me. They are their own people. They're, you know, each one of them is, their, is her own person.